Hello, sweetie. Welcome back to our now Halloween special. <laughs> I'm going to edit in at some point the fact that I'm going to go and uh, check on the chicken wings. So, this is how far ahead we are. I've not cooked chicken wings before. Today, because I brought some extra wings yesterday after seeing you, I've decided to do a test run to see how well cooking chicken wings goes. So, they're in the oven. And I'm going to go check on them in a minute. This is before Friday, so I haven't been to work yet. So I don't know how well this is going to go. <laughs> so I thought I'd squeeze in a bit of this and just randomly edit where I can. Because I was hoping to do it earlier in the day and just been sidetracked by booking our trip to uh, the theatre and stuff. And generally diary sinking. That seems like a body. Oh, that's outside. Okay. Yeah, I just kind of didn't want to... <laughs> I went to get that done. That seemed like it was more important than this, which I'm planning like nine months ahead. So so at this point, we've not seen either Curious Doug or the... Uh... Oh. A notion at the end of the lane. We've not seen either yet. Can I pull one? Oh, can I jump on one of these hooks? Grab hold. Hey, look at that. Shoes everywhere. Why shoes? It's hauntingly weird. I'm not sure why shoes, but shoes is a, a thing. Am I going to have to deal with this? Tim Burton caricature. I keep coming back to Tim Burton, but he's like my only reference point for, for things of this sort of nature. Sort of. It's almost cartoony in the way it's sort of it's like cartoony and almost well obviously it's meant to be like almost like a childlike view of the world. Um sort of exaggerated features and things like that. Can I see this is food again. This is hunger. I, I, I mistook this for either being poisoned or the need to shit oneself, but I think it's hunger. So that looks like a mouse trap, which that looks like there's no cheese in. I'm just gonna walk across it and see what happens. I think it's already been triggered actually, saying that. I could use that. <gasps> Can I set that? No. If I find a bit of food, can I just catch a rat? And eat no, <laughs> you'd want to eat a rat raw, but <laughs> video games have taught me anything. It's Things can be food that you otherwise wouldn't eat. Like Mad Max, I, I probably won't play it on here because it's, it's a lot of faffing. I played it for like over two days. It was like, like 50 plus hours I put into that and I absolutely adore it. Um, but you eat dog food in that and you eat maggots out of the stomachs of corpses. It's quite grim. Ugh, okay. Definitely a Halloween special. That's just a bit grim. <laughs> oh, didn't even finish it. Just a mouthful of fur. Oh, it's haunting. Not sure how I feel about this. You know, when some people are like they see the macabre and the dark, and they're they're like they're fine with it. There's always part of me that is just unsettled by it. I don't know if that's the correct response. It's another reason why sometimes I find horror movies harder to watch, I guess. Rather than strictly... If they're not strictly bad, if they're a bit macabre and a bit... Like, they're fascinating. Like, they're sort of like, you can't look away. You're like, oh, I can't help but, but look at this. But at the same time, you're like, I wish I wasn't watching this. <laughs> In a sort of weird way. Push. Come up. Yes. It's like looking at all this, like, you kind of want to know what's in the bags, but you kind of know that you don't want to know the answer. Because you won't like it. Oh. Um, <laughs> I thought there might be something behind there. I didn't think I'd fall down a hole. Well, shit. Oh, well, there's an ornament. Ah. Uh, and a 
such a, a very tall portrait of her. Of that figure from before. Well, I'm assuming it's of the sort of similar figure to what's depicted in the statues. That I keep breaking for reasons I'm not sure. Plays a little musical jingle. Well, bye then. Should meet somebody we don't like, maybe. Oh. Oh, that's neat. There's definitely blood trails. None of this is... Hmm. Oh, mechanics are setting in. The physics are on. I guess I'm going to go drag that over to there. Climb on, jump over. Through the hole. Let's have a go, let's have a go. Okay, jump cut. We're back. Um, I went to check on my chicken wings, and then I basically just ate what's essentially going to be my dinner before work. What was it? I, uh, I ate them. I will say now, because you will probably the probably ask, and we'll probably have this conversation way before you watch this video. But I had like a like, tray of chicken wings, and I thought I'll try and see it. I cook as many as I can because I feel like the chance of nailing nailing it with some of them is better than all of them. <laughs> and there's this huge tub of chicken wings. And it must have been like a couple of dozen, maybe more. But what I ha what happened was I think I overcooked them a little bit and it rendered down some of the meat. So it sort of they were not very they were falling off the bone and that was nice, but they were not very meaty, it, it shrunk a lot, and I don't know if it's the quality of the the chicken I bought, potentially. Maybe there's too much water in it, I'm not sure. Um, sorry, I was just moving the mic there, it makes a hell of a lot of noise when I do that. Um, yeah, it's, um, they were nice, like, the sauce was great, but I, my oven is like a fucking nightmare, so, you know, you put it on 140. Yeah, most recipes are like, put it on 180, and you put it on 140 and the whole thing fucking burns anyway. So I was sort of like, hmm, how best to do this in a way that doesn't result in just wasted food. So I tried my best to cook it a bit beforehand, like slow cook it, things like that. And I went back to it to, to glaze it after I marinated it, took the, the sauce off and then cooked the wings with a little bit of the sauce still on. And then my plan was then to <laughs> was then to cook the cook the wings then glaze them a little put them back in bring them back out turn them glaze them put them back in and they were just like fairly black in some places when I got them out so I was like hmm, I better not uh, I better not just glaze them and pop them back in again because these things are just going to dry out and they'd, they'd reduced in size quite a bit, so... All I'm saying is I'm going to try and do better by you on Friday. If I can. Oh. Hello, fish head. I'm just going to assume that... Everybody in this game wants to fucking kill me. I'm not sure why this particular person would want to do that because they don't meet on me really. Yeah, because then you get the tense music like Jaws. Like you're gonna die. Sausage is sticking out of a saucepan. Interesting. This is an interesting camera angle as well. Ah, fuck. No. Run. Oh, you put the threw me in the oven. Like bloody some sort of witch in a forest. Curse you, forest witch chef person. Also, I'm going to put my charger in my bag ready for work because I've just realised it's nowhere near. It would help if it was near.
Or in. I'm going to put it in in a minute, but I haven't yet. Got my uniform out. <laughs> I have to edit this, come back to it by the day when I'm not working. Try to cut a bit of the fat off. It's not doing a great job of this, this cutting malarkey. So, because you won't see this for months, I may have already done this by then, or I may not, because you got a you got a switch for Christmas. I'm a little bit worried about the size of your hands and holding the switch, so that when you do try it, because I find it really hard, my hands are bigger. But I find the fact that it's so flat kind of hard to hold. So I thought about getting you a case with like grips on the back. So, we'll see how that goes. I may have already done it by then, but I just think when you get hold of it, if you're going to try it, legitimately, you said you feel like playing it on the TV is a bit weird. Like you'd rather play it in your hand. If you say it was weird, but certainly not the way you imagined playing it, I don't think. Then I think... Uh, I think I might try and look into getting you a grip, which no, I have already done it. I did it today. And I'm going to continue to look into it and hopefully order one up so that when you do eventually play your two point hospital on your switch that you can actually grab the damn thing because I know you've got sore hands, they're tiny and they're lovely but they're, they get a little sore so I'm like it's part of my reason for looking into the, the, the getting you the kindle when I did because I figured you love your books and holding your books but some of the books I got for you for Christmas were quite massive I thought maybe a digital thing Better. Oh, I need a key. Right, I guess I'll climb this then. It's like, a, it's like a salt cupboard that does. Right, that's where you put the seasoning. Come on, I'm gonna light this lantern. Okay, no regrets. I'm feeling less tense playing this today, and I don't know why. I don't feel like my butt is so tight. And my whole body tense is like when I'm like to that scary, scary, scary thing. I'm hoping everybody in this universe is relatively blind so I can use this sort of light with impunity. Just do, 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 do. Although it's fairly bright in there anyway. Right, so I'm climbing a bit higher. Come on up this side. What's up this side? Oh no. You can hear this pulsating, I don't know if it comes across in the video. In the audio. I can hear it pulsing in the headset. Hello. 
little disappointed that I don't seem to be able to set fire to toilet paper. Like, that's the mechanic we were all craving. Like, lighting and throwing toilet paper. This is progress. Well, I kind of don't want to get in the lift. Because that little fella's run off. And I feel like there's a collectible theme around there. The weird people with the cones on the hand. Like Dunce's hands. Key's definitely over there. How am I meant to get over there? I bet I've got to knock something off on a shelf over there and walk over with it. Maybe. Yes, leap of faith. Could quite see that shelf. I was just <laughs> wildly guessing. Nope, coming up there. Hmm. case to come off. But I'm not sure how. Is there something behind the door? There's something I'm not seeing. Can I stand on this? Will that help me up? I don't know if it's going to be tall enough. No. Oh no, let's jump across. Here, I'm not getting. So I can get on that one. So I can just jump up there. Oh, okay. I made this harder than it should have been.
That's on me. That's just terrible. Dun, 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 dun. Boom. In the left. Magnificent. sense in a kitchen environment for there to be casual streaks of blood everywhere but still it's a little dark going up menswear right don't know if I was meant to do that Interesting. Da 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 da. Ah, gonna climb up here. Jump onto a hook. Let's try that. Arm to the meat. Okay. So a couple of joints. Hams. They stand on the hams. So can I get take one over here? Nope. Nope. Let's go downstairs then, because I felt like I saw a lever or a pulley of some description. Two hams went in there. Not one ham, but two. It's not registered though, I put two hams in there, I'm gonna have to do it again. Git. It's gonna use it as a as a swing. Three, and this is the third. No, 
Oh, I'm being stupid. Do 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 do. Do 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 Nope. We'll leave him out. That's it. So each joint of ham is like one sausage. It must be the meatiest sausages with actual meat in them, rather than, you know, the standard lips and arseholes. Not a vegan, I just worked for many years in fast food, I <laughs> just know, it's, you don't want to know how the sausage is made. Bom, 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 bom. Of course, Crouch. Come on, Matt, you got this. It's not the same key. Oh, there's a lever here as well. Uh. <laughs> nope, he did spot me. I thought I was enough in the shadows that I could just sit there and wait. Nope, nope, nope. Did not work. Back to it. Sorry, just thought I'd reply to you. Back to our planning. So, if there's weird awkward jump cuts, it's just me trying to plan there. Plan our theatre trip together. Which, by the time you watch this, we'll, <laughs> we will have mostly forgotten about it. I've forgotten about it, but it'll be old news. And that's it. Assuming I'm getting in the lift. Let's go. Yeah. yeah. Probably excited that guy. Better get out. Oh, that's very good. No, no doubt he'll be trying to chase me. I can hear him coming up. Why is it so obsessed? I don't, I don't, I don't get it. this way and find it, but it appears not. Okay. Oh, I don't need to. Stop. I don't know. I think you need to go back up. Oh, there's the fucking... Shit. and generic slop, is that? We need to go into food and games.
Fuck out of here. With this key. <laughs> it is so annoying for that. Like, how dare you? Like, I fucking dare so much. don't know where I am because I'm in a box. Right, okay. Can I get into that chute? Yes. Do I want to? Probably not. Let's go anyway. Go on. I don't know how those things work. I've seen enough chutes. Rubbish chutes and uh, the same as the uh, the sharp spins in hospitals as well. Done, done, done. done. There you go. I thought it was a bit like a ladder. It doesn't go anywhere there. What is this? They sort of put this in the middle of the room, all ominous. I think it's got something to do with anything. There's a tiny hole up there. In the profiterole vision. Oh, it puts me under the floorboards. Yeah. Right. So I can get up there. Get up here. Cage. Soap. Oh, it's nice to see they're clean. I feel what feels like predictably ballistic sort of lunch and I cannot go further okay top of the morning to you so coming up here will likely fuck me over because they can see me I'm guessing hello yes they can see me right They just disperse. They could see me, but they're just going elsewhere. Oh, that was not a casual prompt. Why did you drop this one? <laughs> oh, okay. I don't got squished, ma. I don't got, got squished. You know when something happens, and it seems to happen coincidentally, but it's not because games are programmed a certain way. But when I came up out of there, it was just like, and here it is. This brush has dropped, and I was like, mm, it's gonna be important. Isn't it? Yeah. 
You didn't see anything. You didn't see anything. Nope. You didn't. <coughs> Go away. Go on. Fuck you, boo. This has but I'm carrying it. I'm carrying it over here. Is that a broken dish or broken tiles? Either way, you really need to get it up. I don't think either of you have got shoes on. Traps for me to walk across. You bastard. Alright, so we can get up there quite easily, I think. So we need to figure out how to get upstairs to the hooks. Because the hooks are going the other way. Is it those plates? escaping I'm not anymore I hadn't realized that didn't look like it was gonna take me anywhere near close enough to be caught there oh god oh shit fuck I didn't press sprint early enough because I forgot what button it was because the controls are laid out kind of weird Oh, no, I can still be grabbed. <laughs> Who is shy to this? It's me. It's me. I'm shy to this. Piss poor timing on my part there. God damn. Come on. Let's 
Spookum. So the kitchen, done. Okay. Whew. Okay. Let's not. Let's not do that again. <laughs> I'm debating whether to play the second one after this because I'm not sure my heart can take it. Whoa. I mean, I get it, but oh my god. <laughs> anyway, that, that episode is going to be significantly shorter than the rest. I wanted to do sort of a level for each one, and some of the levels have been longer, and I fucked up. I didn't find really many known people with their hats on in there, so I'm kind of guessing I fucked up there. I saw them, but I didn't really see a chance to hug any of them. I saw one, I think. Strange. Anyway, I love you. Thank you for joining in on me being really tense and failing at really basic stuff. And uh, I'll speak to you soon. Ta-da! <laughs>